It's been a beautiful city. So thanks for living here. It's been a beautiful city. Um, this is uh, this is an exciting time because we, we just put a record out about three weeks ago. Yeah. We Thank you. Yeah, we put a, we put a new record out and um, and this is uh, this is the tour where we support that record and we go out on the road and we play the songs from the record. So um, that's kind of what we're doing here tonight. In case you're here, you're not quite sure what's going on. That's what's happening. And um, this record is a is a particularly special record uh, to me, even though I, I, I yeah, every record that I put out I guess is special, but um, this one's particularly special, which I realize I think I say that every time I put a new record out, but this one in particular because um, this this group of strapping young men that you see around me, um, this is the first time that we've made a record and, and we've done it like as a band, you know. And so, um, so this one, this one is uh, just extra special to me. We um, we recorded it actually back in uh, Indiana, and uh, we're all we're pretty much all from Indiana, by the way. Do we have any any like displaced Hoosiers here? Yeah, nice. Yeah, Indy, it's, it's a magical place, Indiana. Um, and so we recorded it basically like in my house, you know, up in my like. Uh, studio slash guest bedroom is where we did it and um, uh, we made it last summer there was there was one one night last summer after like the band had been hard at work they've been recording and they all go home and then I you know I sit up there on my computer and I fix all their mistakes that they made that whole day you know it takes a long time so it was you know it's like well into the hours of the night and I get this text on my phone um, while I'm working and I, I pick up my phone and it's it's a number that I don't recognize but it's it's a Nashville number from Nashville Tennessee so I think of well of course whoever this is they must work in the music industry and they can somehow further my career so so I open the text up and uh, and it says uh, it says hey my name is Blake Shelton I'm a judge on a, on a TV show called The Voice um, he says, he says, I don't know if this is ringing uh, any bells. That was the whole text. What he said. So it's, you know, it's like two in the morning. I'm sitting there, like, like reading this text. Blake Shelton. This is really Blake Shelton. And I, 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 I'm sure this is really Blake Shelton. I just don't know if he knows that he's texting me. <laughs> like he didn't say my name in the text or anything. He didn't like. He didn't even like ask me a question or anything. This could just be some like blanket like marketing campaign that the voice is doing. You know, like Blake gets the Midwest, and CeeLo gets the East Coast. Kind of thing. Um, so I'm like, you know, I gotta respond, I don't really know what to say. Uh, again, he didn't ask me anything. And so um, I don't know if I should just say like I'll watch it, or I don't know. Um, so I just, I, I opened it up and I was, I was like, uh, I said, hey, yeah, yeah, I know who you are. And then, um, and then I just put a smiley face. I went with my gut and put a smiley face because I didn't have anything else to say. So I just went with the smiley face. I sent it to him and uh, he wrote back and he said, uh, he said, well, listen, there's, there's a girl who's on the show. Um, her name is Senya. And she's a big fan of your music, and she's on my team, Team Blake. And he said, you know, we shoot the, the TV show in L.A. He's like, I don't know if you live in L.A., but if you do, just come by and take a picture with her. I think, you know, she'd like to meet you. And, uh, and so I, I got on YouTube, and I listened to this girl's voice. And as soon as I heard her voice, I was like, she has, like, one of the coolest voices I've ever heard. I was like, this girl has got to sing on our record somehow. And so... So I was actually flying out to LA that next week. So I took the song I was working on, I flew out to LA, you know, I gave her a call, we met up at a studio, and uh, she sang uh, a duet on, on the record. And she did an amazing job, she's an amazing artist, and uh, this is the song, it's called Maybe It's Over. Oh, uh -huh. 
Yeah. 